tenure of local government chairman ends in 2026. I next chair Jacobo speaks. Hmm. Hey, I don't already the boy. I don't already the boy with the heading. The news in detail. Let's find out more. The chairman of the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, Mahmoud Yakubu, on Friday explained that the tenure of the current local government and council chairman will end in June 2026 and not 2025. To this end, Yakubu explained that INEC will not conduct local council's elections in 2025. Jacobo said the provisions of the Electoral Act 2022 as amended with respect to the tenure of Area Council Chairman in the Federal Capital Territory, FCT, guarantees a four-year tenure for the Chairman and Councillors, not the three years provided in the Electoral Act 2010. Speaking during the meeting with the Inter-Party Adversary Council, IPAC in Abuja, Jacobo noted that the tenure of a current chairman and councillor would lapse in June 2026. Jacobo said the inquiries were based on the provisions of the Electoral Act 2010 as amended, which was a subsidiary law. At the time, elections to the area councils were held on Saturday, 12 February 2022. According to Yakubu, Nigerians are aware that the National Assembly has since repelled and reenacted the Electoral Act 2010 as amended as the Electoral Act 2022. In particular, in the exercise of its powers as a lawmaking body of the FCT, the National Assembly extended the tenure of the area councils from three to four years, thereby aligning it with executive and legislative elections nationwide. This is one of the important provisions of the Electoral Act 2022. The act came into force on Friday, 25th, February 2022, two weeks after the last area council's election in the FCT. By the time the elected chairman and councillors were sworn in four months later on 14th June 2022, they took their oath of allegiance and oath of office on the basis of the new Electoral Act, that is the Electoral Act 2022, which provides for a four-year tenure. Consequently, their tenure therefore expires in June 2026. For the of doubt, tenure is not defined by the date of election but the date of oath of office or for executive elections or the date of inauguration for legislative office houses. For the executive, the tenure belongs to the elected individual, while for legislature, the tenure belongs to the legislature. The president, vice president-elect, governor, deputy governor-elect, Senator-elect, member-elect, chairman-elect, or councillor-elect cannot exercise the power of office and draw from the remuneration attached to it until such a person is sworn in or the legislative house is inaugurated. Wow. <laughs> what did I just read now? They mean to tell us that... Um, Chairman now, local government chairman now four years and would they use not be three years again? Huh. Okay. <laughs> Why am I sensing that it is because of Winky the night and the you know um, at this point I don't even know what to even say. I cannot say if this thing was actually truly truly amended. Let me say they would just want rubbish. Um, I don't, I'm not feeling. I'm not feeling good about this. I did tell you. Hmm. Now wow, now wow, now wow. Okay, now is he coming out to say is a federal law or in the FCT? Because I don't get. I don't want to believe that it is in the FCT alone. Because come on, come on. I can can they be four years in FCT and other states three years? It doesn't make sense to me. It get as this thing be. Shakubi knows about electoral act and could not implement it during the last presidential election. Shakubi, it is you and God. See this man. I don't want to talk too much for this man matter because this man, in generational, in share of waiting the full lamp, where I know, see, forget, waiting the full of this man. This is not a matter of uh, the vibrations with the full lamp and a generation where they come, we come after them. People will go, people will escape, and the people will be say, as in, people will escape, and my parents. I tell you, 
What did this man go see? This man generation go see. Uh uh. Like, what's the asset to everything they do? You see, it may not be poverty, you. Like, like. They can, they feed on hozu, you understand, make everybody on soft. But you see that cost, then go bear them. Then go bear them. This, because this, what this man cost? What in this man cost? No, no. I no, no, no. Now you come outside now again. Come the young this one. In fact, this man, next time you come outside, I feel saying you know they come outside for better thing again. Now for sorrow, sorrows and tears. Okay. So you're waiting for it. You have not given Nigerian citizens any best selection. And you're talking about local government council. Why did they even increase it? So now, local government election. What is going on in this country first? They want to tell me that local government election and... Well, what's it called? Presidential election and governorship election is the same. Is it even supposed to be the same? I just the ask. Okay. When will the tenure of this man expire? Will he be allowed to stay in office to conduct another abracadabra election? My dear, I can't see. The meaning is the chairman of INEC will not see 2027 election. <laughs> Everybody is not just happy. What's going on? Please, guys, this man is talking about FCT areas council, not other states. All states, my darling. All states. There is no way they can change a particular thing in a local government and it is now affecting only one state. It's not possible. I'm not sure it's possible. Hmm. This man should never show his face to the public. I they tell you, this man a messenger of doom. This man not carry better. You know, carry better this thing for Nigerians. If he says, immediately I see him, I just say, ah, sorry, this man show. Then I can't read the head and I say, huh. I say, huh. Okay, oh. If the law was changed since 2022, why 2024 reverse assembly extended local government tenure for six months, adding to the past three years in office in the first place, or they don't know their law again? My dear, I have a lot of questions to ask. Not only you. Not only you get questions because I am just here thinking. We kill on, we kill on, we kill on, we kill on, soap. Why have it been quiet all this while? Why is it that now they won't come outside do this thing? Ah, I know this one must with me. Oh. The most corruption in the, the most corrupt man in the history of INEC in this in this so called country called Nigeria. Typical example of Nigeria we hold. Make me share the watch rating going for because I don't think this is good news for River State people. Right on this note, we've come to the end of the news. We say thank you for tuning in to listen until I come your way next time. Enjoy the rest.